Well, hello, and welcome back to Idle Kingdom Defense. So today, 17275, and of course, don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe, and make sure to ring that bell. That said, this is King's Ruin. You know it, I know it, we all know it, we've all done it. I am considering making this video less frequent when I start pushing. I'm kind of on the fence about that and how I would do it. I don't I don't know for sure yet. But it is something I'm like 120 million percent considering. Especially if King's Ruin gets long again and it starts taking, you know, an hour or two to do. I, I just... I Even a sped up version of that I don't feel like is worth it. So, I might just do it like once a I, I'm thinking once a week. But I'm split on the day I would do it once a week. I do think that seeing this probably every day is a bit much. And that probably switching to a weekly format, especially in the future when it takes longer, makes a ton more sense than what, what I'm doing now. I just don't know when I'd make that transition. So that's something I'm kind of kicking around in the back of my head. Obviously, when I make that transition, makes everything all, you know. I'll, I'll keep everybody posted on when and why I make that transition, but that's really the reason I'm kicking around. Just because it takes a lot of time, and as we push, it's going to take longer. And there's not too much variance in a day-to-day -day version of King's Throne. Week to week can actually have a decent amount of variance because we'd be working on Marion for a week and eventually be working on Vincent for a week at a time. So I do think that'd be a little more interesting to see how the benchmarks change. So that's something I'm really kicking around in the back of my head. I can't, you know, again, like the whole purpose of King, like without, the, the whole reason I want to include King's Ruin still and I, why I haven't dropped it is it's a great way to show the growth of the heroes over time. Now, obviously, you do remember as we went from having to speed this up to progressively having to speed it up less and less to starting to do all the stages to now where I do 11 of the stages in one video and it takes about eight minutes. So there is some clear progress we can see from there. And of course, we've seen Marion's damage just sky and Christian, to be fair, just skyrocket because of that. So, I mean, there to me, there is some value. I just don't know how to present it. Um, but again, like, like, I do believe the value reflected in a weekly video would be great. I also just have to figure out when I would want to do that. I'm sort of leaning to recording it on a Tuesday, and then that would post on a Friday... So it'd be kind of like Friday, you know, King's Ruin Friday. I'm looking forward to the weekend. I think that might be good. I mean, I will make a decision, you know, again, and, and again, right now it's fine. It's quick. It doesn't matter. This is a future. This is very much a future state. And it likely wouldn't even need to happen until much further, you know, much further along. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, anything. It's a, it's a, it's a work in progress. Like all things, right? I'm a work in progress. Maybe you're a work in progress. I at least consider myself a work in progress. Always something I can work on. Always something I can work on, something I can change, something I can improve. And we did get 100% there, so everybody's doing double damage for this, which is nice. Marion will one-shot everything, which is very nice. So she's just playing cleanup. Okay, things are making it to the castle. And of course, everybody else doing double damage too is nice. That does mean they might actually hurt something. 
There, there's a chance they could hurt some. Marion got a bad uh, attack there in the back. And then it's just the AoE stage, and I mean, none of these stages are a challenge at this point. And that, that's part of the other reason, like, you know, I, honestly, looking back, I wonder how I didn't arrive at this. I, I think I've been kicking this around for a long time. It's just like King's Ruin to me was so fundamental for the game, and it used to be like it didn't, like, what happened was it didn't used to take that long. Basically, I think I think I want to say before the mythic update, it wasn't it was long enough to require its own uh, video series, but it wasn't so long that that it was like oh goodness this is you know this is taking an eternity. A lot of that had to do with Sophia. Sophia was you know before the mythic update, Sophia was still a good hero and I used her. But I hadn't leveled her up and developed her to the point where she was strong enough to, like, prolong the battles indefinitely. Um, and then, and then, see, the issue, too, is when they came up with Berserk, the original implementation of Berserk was okay. But the issue with the original implementation was that if you, it, like, if they started the game with that implementation of the Berserk, it would have been fine. I don't think it would have been great for the state of the game. I think they would have had to tweak the... Like, they would have had to build the game around it. But if we started with that version of Berserk, and basically, you know, I think it was like 10 minutes or so, you were done with the stage. Because basically they would go to Berserk 3 and then just annihilate you. Unless you could uh, survive through that. I think that would have been okay. The issue is they entered, by the time they introduced it, they did, it wasn't like they nerfed everything into response of adding Berserk. They didn't. So it was, so like, it was a big, it sucked. It just sucked. And here's the final stage. And there we go. Oh, that's actually, I think, our 640th, isn't it? It is! 640 victories. So, that said, as always, once again, thank you, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to support the channel. If you have any questions, feel free to say something in the comments. I do always look forward to your questions. And as always, thank you again, and I hope you have a great day.